What's the time limit to avail Senvat credit? Prior to 1st of September 2014, there was no time limit specified to avail Senvat credit, however with amendment in rules a time limit of 6 months was specified which later was extended to 1 year effective from 1st of March 2015. But following questions remain unanswered completely, what happens to invoices dated prior to 1st of September 2014? What happens to invoices issued between 1st of September 2014 and 28th of February 2015? Where the time limit of one year would apply to such invoices? See, what happens to those cases, where credit has been reversed and subsequently taken? To explore the above questions, one has to read section with any circulars or case laws. In the above case, department did issue a circular on this. Let's see what proviso to rule 4 says, provided also that the manufacturer or the provider of output service shall not take SENVAT credit after one year of the date of issue of any of the documents specified in subrule of rule 9 inches. On plain reading of the above provision, it is very clear that if invoices are issued on or after the 1st of March 2015, then one year time limit applies, but still the question remains whether time limit will really apply to invoices issued before 1st September 2014. What happens when there is a reversal and subsequent credit is taken, in this scenario, attention is invited to the circular no. 990-14-2014 CX8 Below is the abstract from the circular, the matter has been examined. The purpose of the amendment made by notification number 21 2014 stated the 11th of July 2014 is to ensure that after the issue of a document under subrule of rule 9, credit is taken for the first time within six months of the issue of the document. Once this condition is met, the limitation has no further application. It is, therefore, clarified that in each of the three situations described above pertaining to Rule 4, Rule 3 or Rule 4 of CCR, 2004, the limitation of six months would apply when the credit is taken for the first time on an eligible document. It would not apply for taking re-credit of amount reversed, after meeting the conditions prescribed in these rules. From the above it can be derived that there is no time limit where there has been reversal and subsequent credit has been taken.